So this is directions to get to the 0.658 acre property in Mountain Shadows. As you can see, Google Maps only takes you part of the way there, um, but it will be much easier if you keep on going rather than jumping over uh, these other properties as it tells you to. So you can see in this view on Google Maps that um, you'll drive up Mountain Shadows Road. There's only one entrance to the subdivision. You'll take a right, and then there'll be a house right up there. Um, and I will turn this onto the satellite view. You'll see this house with the red roof. <clears throat> and you'll continue following Mountain Shadows Road, and Google Maps will actually stop you there. Uh, it doesn't know that these other roads exist, and um, it doesn't know how to take you all the way there. So I will go ahead and show you the rest of the way. You can see Mountain Shadows Road continues, and I'm just drawing it with my blue cursor here. And then you come to a fork in the road. You either go left, continue on Mountain Shadows, or go right. Um, you can see there's another house there. So I'll turn this to satellite view. You can see the roof of that house right there. Once you see that house, you're actually going to take a right. Right after that, it's relatively obvious what it looks like. But then you can just continue, and you're going to go up. This is uh, quite a slope, and the condition of the road might ne necessitate walking at this time. Um, but it could use some clearing and then you would be able to drive up it. It's in okay shape. So you just continue that until you get to the, the cul-de-sac and you'll see a house, small off-grid cabin on the lot to the left of this property and then you'll see the property itself.